this is my passion. This is Ike's Outdoors. Hey guys, Ike here from Ike'sOutdoors.com. I'm here today to do a review on the bunker head face mask and hoodie system. And you may have seen the other video I put up. I used this system wrong in that video. And uh, I wanted to read I'm gonna redo the video to show you the proper way to use it. Make mistakes from time to time. And I uh, took the video down, so we'll fix it in this video and show you a proper way of using this thing. Um, the way I used it then worked pretty well. The way this thing works now is even better. Um, the bunker system, get right up close to the camera here, starts out with these clips and this band right here. You can actually see how that clips right to my hat. So we got two clips right there and clips to my hat. We have a band that goes right across here. And right here is a good strong, looks like a molded plastic or some type of good strong material. It's got two holes in it. That's going to be the base of your system. So as it is just like this, if, I wanna, if I've got this on my hat, I can use it to hold my sunglasses, which I wear glasses a lot, but in the summertime when I'm bow fishing, I do wear my contacts and uh, use my sunglasses for fishing. Um, so you can hold sunglasses in there. You can also take um, limbs, which you can see it's cold winter time and it's snowing I don't have a lot of foliage around right now but you can take foliage and you can shove right in there and it'll hold foliage and break up your outline if you're out fishing you want to throw some fishing lures in there if you fish like I do I go a lot of times and just jump in a creek and bow fish or or uh, trout fish or something like that you can just shove extra lures right in there under that strap and it'll hold them right secure to your hat and you can pull them out and use them as you need them um, so the next step of this system all you got to do to take your hat off is take your hat off you take this piece right here, which is your hoodie. You actually run it right in the holes on the outside here. I'm going to run that right there and just bend it around. Same way over here. Right in that hole. Bend it around and it's secure. Wrap this thing right around the back of your hat. Place your hat on. And you have a hoodie. This is going to break up your the sun beat down on your neck. Going to keep the the heat off of you. Going to break up your outline when you're hunting without putting a face mask on you. You can also take this thing. It's got Velcro right here. You can Velcro this thing around just like this and keep the wind off your ears. You've got a lot of added bonuses just like that. So you got to add the hoodie that quick and that easy. Um, you can use these too. You can also use these free. You don't have to use the hoodie, you can, uh, the face mask. You can use each one of these components separately, but you got to have the bunker system on the front. So I'm going to go ahead and add the, the, the no-touch face mask, which to me is the, the best part of the system. I really love this no-touch face mask. You just slide it right in the other hole, and it slides in there. It's nice, tight fit. It's not loose or anything like that. Slide it right there into that hole, just like that. Pull your hoodie back, and you can put this thing on just like that. And like I said, this is a no-touch face mask. You can see I got space in between my face and the mask. And for me, wearing glasses in this type of weather, I hate having something up against my face. I hate having a, a mask on even when I'm wearing my, my contacts. This one stays away from your face. It's 100. It's a, no contact at all. You can set it up in a, a variety of different ways. I can set it up just like this. I can actually fold it down out of place if I want to just take this thing off or take it out of the way. All I got to do is that. Now my face is completely clear. I can drink water. I can I can do whatever I want to do with this face mask uh, down. Put it back into place. All I got to do is that. If I don't like that shape, I can shape it up a little bit differently. Get it up a little bit higher. Cover up a little bit more of my face. I can also take this hoodie and incorporate it. It's got velcro on the sides I can velcro it right to it I can velcro it underneath and fan this thing out a little bit so the no touch face mask is awesome I can move my head without it messing up my my vision without it binding up I don't have any straps going around my head and honestly with this thing on right now I really don't even know it's there I can see this part of the mask but if I tuck this thing down I don't feel it at all which is awesome and I'm a face painter you guys have seen my hunting videos you know I'm a face painter I like to have I don't like having a mask on so I've always resorted to using the old oily face paint and some of the stuff like that and um, I mean it works pretty good but this mask is mossy oak it's got a good breakup pattern on the front uh, three-dimensional the back is mossy oak so it guys provides you a good uh, camouflage pattern 
completely hides your face, doesn't touch your face, doesn't bind up, doesn't constrict, and I really like it. And coming from a guy who's, I never wear a face mask. I've always hated it. This one is, is absolutely, it solves the problems that I've always ran into with the traditional face mask. And I really like it. And of course, shooting, you know, I've got a, just a little pistol, or a little rifle here. Of course, you can shoot your rifle with it. It's absolutely no problem. Your rifle, your shotgun, or whatever. Um, I'm going to step back here and shoot my bow just to show you guys that you can shoot a bow with this thing on as well. All right, so let's try this thing out here with the bow. It's like that. I had, did have one little problem. I just had to maneuver my head a little bit. I had it up just a little bit high right here. Just like that, I'm going to fix that problem. It just made, just got in the way of my peep sight just a little bit. But other than that, I'm shooting a T-handle release. Really got to get in there tight on my face. No problem shooting it with the, with the bunker head on. So, uh, very good product. And coming from a guy who doesn't like face masks, who's always been a face painter and always hated these these face masks because they bind up, they constrict, and they get in your way. Um, you know, I, I definitely give it my seal of approval and definitely give it a big thumbs up. I, I really like this system. I like the versatility to it. I like the way that, it, you know, it solves the problems as I've always ran into with these systems in the past. I can shoot my gun. I can shoot my bow. I can mold it to whatever shape that I want to. Um, I can wear it in unison with everything else or I can wear each piece individually. So it's got a lot of good versatility to it. It's got a good camo uh, pattern to it. It's going to work excellent for turkey hunting, for deer hunting, for doing a, a wide variety of things. Um, so more information on this bunker head, you can check it out. We'll put the website right here. For more product reviews, how-to videos, you can check out our website at ikesoutdoors.com. Appreciate you guys watching.